this is a shop. thing in the future when you get like some equipment you can like find this or something. I don't know. Oh, cool. Honest Before piece that. of feedback for this game. Yeah. Um, they should add uh, Boba Fett and Bruno Mars. Okay, that's I, I about, walked in front of your shot. That there's no excuse for that for me. I apologize. About, what about a little bit of Ariana Grande? <laughs> you Grande. know what? Yes, please. Let's get that. I'll I'll take an Ariana Indeed. Venti. <laughs> you know what I mean? Good one. Thank you. Mel. I'll I'll take an Ariana. Tall. I'm really upset about that one. You love it. You know what? I'm taking all of these. I'm taking all of that. That's the tax you have to pay because that joke was terrible. Oh, dude, I forgot that. So we were in Washington uh, State at our in-laws' place this weekend. It's a, like a pretty small town. Uh, tough people last. Plus two, plus two. That game was not good. It's crazy how much better than Tarkov it is while still not being any fun at all. I'm sorry. I look. It it only gets me in trouble because anytime you're like positive about a game, people are like, "Well, it's nice. I like when he has fun." Um, but I might not think that that game's amazing. But I like when he has fun. Uh, but whenever you like a game comes out, the best. There's no way I should finish third on this one. Did you see what just happened? <laughs> I am thinking, like, how funny would it be if, after all, all the shit we've been through, if I uh, end up being diagnosed with a tapeworm, and then they give me ivermectin. I don't even know, like, I think I would just have to die. I don't think I could bring myself to take it at this point. But it, it would be a hilarious uh, prognosis for sure. No doubt about it. I've been having the most fucked up dream. Ellen threw him off in one of those games last time we played Fall Guys. Ooh! That shit tilted me to oblivion. But then I was like, you know what? I'm proud of him. Is it true that to remove a tapeworm, they just hold food outside of your butt and wait for the worm to poke his head out? I do not think that that's true. That can't possibly be the, the way that you treat a tapeworm. There's no way that it is. It actually is. Come on, man. There's no way. And then they yank it out. I'm a doctor is true. You guys are actually, you're totally lying to me. You tell, they don't just give you like a, a dewormer, like a veterinary dewormer or something like that. No, they do not put a mouse trap on your ass. Come on. This is not a joke. This is my life, okay? I can't make it past the hammers. Whoa! This has been the weirdest round of Fall Guys of all time. It's been like the easiest rounds. We're gonna have a final with uh, eight people in it. Or I don't know, are we even on the finals? If it's actually a worm, can you take a photo of it on Twitter? Well, sure, if they do the thing where they play the clarinet right next to my butthole until it gets charmed and it comes out, then I would, I would take a photo of it for sure. But if it's a tapeworm, I'm pretty sure they're just gonna give me some pills. And then, like, I'm gonna crap it out amongst all the other detritus that I've been excising from my body lately. Dude, yeah, don't, don't they just use that gun from the Matrix? Where they see the tapeworm, like, crawling around in your stomach and then they isolate it with that weird claw gun? Everyone knows on Fall Mountain you go right side. It's just the fastest path. It's simple science. 
the sweet science, boxing. I'd say acceptable path so far. I'm not worried about low grav. I'm not worried about low grav in the slightest. I love that for me. That seemed amazing. Can I make it on the first cycle? I don't think so. I'm insane. I'm I'm the best to ever play Fall Guys. That was so easy. <laughs> He's back, baby. Thank you, little Caesar. High five. Okay. Choose prediction. Win the finals. I mean, dude, it's hard to get like a super belief in Fall Guys. Because 15% uh, of people thought I was going to win that one. It's a game with 60 people in it. We got to get fewer believers. But I know that's a hard position to argue from when we just won. So it's hard to say. Okay, there you go. I'm going to make a tweet. Hello. Let's just say hello. I'm playing Fall Guys. I gotta, I gotta pump the analytics a little bit after playing the Cycle Frontier. I gotta let people know. Hey, I'm playing basic games again. I thought that those games for adults, people that hold PhDs in engineering. I'm not touching that shit anymore. Okay. I'm back to playing stuff where you could just turn it on and it's like Coco Melon for adults. With Little Caesar. Gaming with Little Caesar? Honestly, this seems like the kind of title that if the corporation was paying attention to Twitch, I could easily get sued. Dude, that was a hard obstacle course. I made it. Nice callback. Thank you. Thank you. I have no original thoughts in my head right now. All I've got is, um, we few. We happy few. We band of brothers. For all men who spill blood with me this day are my brother. May they ne'er be so vile. But battle gentle their condition. And all men will count themselves weak they were not here this Crispin's day. I mean, like, all I got in my head is, like, I don't know how to describe it to you because the concept of a modern sitcom doesn't really exist anymore. They've all been turned into, like, the office knockoffs. Like Parks and Rec and Modern Family and Superstore, okay? My parents like Frasier, they're a little bit racist. Yeah, your parents probably also like rotisserie chickens from Costco. That doesn't mean that everybody who eats rotisserie chickens from Costco is racist. Frasier was a very likable show. It cast a wide umbrella. It brought people together. Some people were laughing at Frasier because they're like, the show is droll. Some people were laughing at Frasier. I mean, I'm not saying it was, I, like I get what they were going for, but it was just so weird. They were definitely high on pod noose when they made this movie. It's kind of pretentious too. Okay, then go back to watching Doolittle. I'm sick of this. Oh, it's pretentious. Well, so every movie has to be like John Wick 1. This, this shit is getting crazy. A movie can't try to be art house. It just has to back into it accidentally. John Wick is pretentious. Ooh! <laughs> Hereditary is literally just paranormal activity for people who don't like found footage films. Apocalypse Now is literally just Kramer versus Kramer for people that are scared of divorce. You see, I can just make shit up, too. The Godfather is literally just 2001 A Space Odyssey for people who love the Mafia. Anyone can construct a sentence, okay? You're not special. For your information, it's not that I don't like 
found footage films is that they make me throw up. So please don't make fun of my affliction, please. If I, I would ask you politely. Bring stolen from us. I haven't made the finals in like an hour, man. Get me out of here. This is crazy. Lose before finals. I'm feasting. I'm war chesting, man. Maybe don't ignore golds. <laughs> you, you honestly, you should work at the American education system by how quickly you crushed my dreams and how useless your feedback was. If you ever got uh, big crimson ink, do better next time. Thanks so much. Thanks so much. I'm coming to school with an empty stomach every damn day. You're mad at me because I got one thing wrong. I'm at eight time times tables. We all got supercomputers in our pockets. The whirly gig. This is still in the game. Source, dude, just trust me. Nothing wrong with that. Enable clean. Dude, there's so much emoji inflation. When I was a when I was a young streamer, there were like six emotes. Resident Sleeper, Fish Mole, Kappa, and then colon right parentheses. Blast ball. Avoid the falling floor and throw blast balls at your opponents. Okay. I don't even know what clean is. It's still going quick. Still quick with it. Not not as quick with it. Not as quick with it. Let me go. Holy cow, they caught me just endlessly bouncing. I look like the damn Dow Jones out there. In. Oh. <laughs> I believed. Holy cow. Max who? Max for who? Max for step who? Very close. I don't think so. Found out about tiger flavor ice cream yesterday. What's your take? Is it is this a Canadian thing? I thought it was like a universal thing. When I was a kid, it was part of the top 10 or 15 ice cream flavors. Tiger Tail, it's orange flavored ice cream with black licorice in it. It Do not say it's top tier. It's my favorite. Guys, like it's fucking horrible. It's the, <laughs> it's the worst. I need to try it. I mean, it, like, you could try it if you want, but, like... Okay, well, I, I can't really complain about that one. It just hit me in the damn face. You got me pretty good on that one. Six, well, Dude, we, we've really burned out the believers, huh? 62% lose before finals? I do have to say, though, my wife and I wouldn't say we argue about this, but my number one... Ice cream flavor, without a doubt, is mint chocolate chip. And she thinks that's stupid because it tastes like toothpaste. Which I can't really disagree with, except we use Sensodyne, which is not so minty. But I, I love cold mint flavors, man. I mean, honestly, if they took the chocolate chips out, I would still order it. Although I do think the chocolate adds something. I would eat just like mint flavored ice cream and be. <laughs> I can't get it over. He knows. He's like, just, just keep hitting him the ball. He'll screw it up. I can't disagree. Oh, what a shot, though. Yes! Just hit it once. That's all you got to do. 
Holy cow! My streamer! <laughs> oh, man. Whew. Little Caesar, my tapeworm! My Paris! Honestly, good tactical move on your part. Sorry, I've, we've, we've all grabbed each other instead of grabbing the person we were supposed to grab. That's, that's a problem. You knew it was coming. Holy cow. Many people said it couldn't be done. All you need is to be going against the current at the exact right time. He's cracked. What can I say? Win the finals 10%? Just a simple, honest question. There's always something simmering under the surface, okay? They're not better than that. Okay, but be that as it may. It's like being like a bouncer at a bar, you know? You gotta identify, like, persons of interest as soon as they walk in. I see a first-time message that says, How much do you think you resemble an adult Caillou? Guess what? I'm keeping an extra eye on you for the rest of the night. You slip up once, your ass is out on the damn pavement. Whoa! Oh my god, he does. No, it's very not based. <laughs> he was caught for racketeering? What the hell is racketeering? Isn't that when you run like an illegal lottery? I don't think anybody knows what racketeering even is. I think it's just when the government wants to put you in prison, but they don't have like a real crime. Like what the hell is racketeering? He ran a crime organization that was doing gun running? That's racketeering? I thought racketeering was when you ran an illegal lottery. Why would I? Why would? Why would I do that? Why would I? What, what was I? Why would I do that? What was I thinking? What, what? What? What was I thinking? I literally just jumped and dived onto the thing that shot me into nothing. What was I thinking? I don't. Know, I, I'm gonna play chess today. I don't know if I'm cut out though. I still gotta warm up my brain a little bit. Racketeering is extortion with a threat of violence. I don't buy it. Racketeering. Dishonest and fraudulent business dealings. I'm just going to go ahead and say it. You got the word fraudulent in the description of the crime, but fraud is another crime. It's, it, it's like using a word to define itself. R. Kelly was also sentenced on racketeering. One of the most common forms is the protection racket in which a criminal entity causes a problem and sells protection against that problem. Oh, you mean like um, Equifax? Hey, um, give us all your personal information so we can make sure no one's stolen your identity. Oh, sorry, we got hacked and lost all your personal information. Here's your $17 class action lawsuit. He was originally... Ooh. I'm scared. Bro, I, my final's due soon. Can I copy your homework? Sure, just don't make it um, worse. I'm alive? That was good, though. That was good. Among Us. Dude, I, screw you guys. I'm proud of that. 
I mean, like all the criticisms are like essays that are designed to like hurt me on a spiritual level. And then all the compliments are just like plus two, plus two. Every criticism is like, you think it's because you were an only child and didn't face uh, any kind of strife growing up that you're quick to anger when your preconceived notion that your mommy special boy is challenged? Do you, you think it's possible that that's happening? And then when I say something uh, very droll, people just say plus two. They don't say, wow, what an incredible joke. It's the best joke I've ever heard. Plus two, you are my hero. Thanks, that helps. appreciate that you said droll two times this stream you should watch another streamer i'll see you in five minutes if that's your standard you're on the wrong damn website you know what website you need to go to if you're sick of seeing the same words over and over it's called wordle.com newyorktimes.com slash wordle free to play every day there's a new word there and then you should definitely post your results on social media. I'm sure thousands of people would be thrilled to see um, how you're doing. Also, what is this? What is this nightmare? I need to thank you. Thank you. Maybe there was a time, but, uh, you know, briefly. Did anyone say that? Dozens of people. I actually filtered out. I only read the compliments that were honest. A lot of them like, were so exaggerated as to be almost a little bit patronizing. Plus two, you look very nice today. Thank you. I've, I've shedded a lot of water weight over the past two weeks. Appreciate it. I said shedded, shedded. Okay, put me in the pipe. This one's not that bad, man. We can make this one. They're, they're so focused on talking about the pipes. Aw, oh, shit. This one's not that pipe driven. It's way more of just like an obstacle course. I think we honestly did pretty well there. I, I think a lot of people will get bounced once. No sweat. No sweat. That was beautiful. Split the damn defense. Beautiful. Dude, we made up a lot of positions. Okay, you don't need to dive onto that one right away. Just, just use your damn brain. You know it's coming back. Peg, it will come back to you. Perfect. Physics, grab the trapeze, make it in. You know how to do it. Let's go! Okay, I knew it. I knew it. Top 10 bald streamers. You know what's crazy? It's only going to get like harder to make that list. Because as time goes on, more and more streamers will become bald. That's so gettable. Especially when all the good players are gone. Which they will be soon. This is... Dude, it's untapped real estate. It's a completely untapped market. That's unbelievable. The bounty that we just had available to us over there. I don't even know what to say. It, it was fertile land. <laughs> it was... <laughs> oh my god. That was like being the first corn farmer in Nebraska, man. That was like... What do I do with all this corn? Holy cow. Me in the 17th century be like... So true. So true. What a knowledgeable joke about Nebraska. You didn't have to say that. Thank you. What an incredible joke. It's the best joke I've ever heard. Stick around. We got more where that came from.
Blast Ball. Okay, careful. Halfway through the game, it starts going faster. Should I tip my waitress? I mean, it depends where you live. We can do that if you want. We got an hour and a half left of stream. We can we can do the thing where we argue about tipping, and then we all end up agreeing that it's basically stupid, and servers should all actually be paid like a living wage without requiring the customers to directly subsidize it. While at the same time recognizing that that's not the system that we actually exist in, right? Hey Daniel, it doesn't happen too much. I do have a rook right now. It's a very good move. I take, you pin me. But I'm okay with it. Because... I mean, we can just do this. We could just protect it. <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> but hold on, look at this. Now we got a discovered check coming on your, on your dang king, and we got your queen under attack. Now this is chess. Literally blind. I mean, I warned you. I said I have not been playing good chess lately. Did I say it or did I say it? Did I say it or did I spray it? This is the worst game I've ever seen. You should check out your own game reviews from time to time. I have a discovered attack on whatever I please. Never mind, I'm trapped. I'm telling you, this person is like a grandmaster level. Well, their bishop is pinned, so that's nice. I got that. Go game review on that one. <laughs> this is why you don't tell stories while you play chess the whole time, I think, as well. But um, I, I played in a local... Uh, oh, no, it's the damn Anglin Gambit. I think you just g give the pawn back at some point and embrace that. You know what I say? Go ahead. Get your knight out of position or whatever. Do whatever feels right. Get your dang queen developed. See if I care. You know what? Let's see if you know how... Oh, no! It, I told you it's a disaster! Anyway. I played in our local chess club uh, in my hometown growing up. What am I doing? Now I'm stacking up my, my rooks for reasons on my notes. Especially strange because this ain't even a rook. What have I done? Okay, good move. Solid move. Look at these openings we got, though. What are you going to do? Ah! Ooh. Resignation terror. Yay! We did it. Bullet win 2022. Holy cow. What an incredible fork. We forked. But we're, we're gaining time. We're gaining time. Holy cow. Do it. I can catch it. I cannot catch it. I'm dead. <laughs> I'm not even. Oh, let's go. Oh, man. Whew. 
Honestly, three of the easiest wins I would like to think that I've ever won in my entire life. Bullet chess. That's what it's all about, baby. 